What's up, y'all? Got a couple mutt head to head season games. See, we're taking on this Dallas Cowboy like team, KIL. I don't know what it stands for. Kicking it outside, I don't know what it means. Whatever. They got Blake Bortles as the quarterback. Ah, and we playing a little bit of defense in the flat. That still was a, too big of a game. He gave up, I believe that was Jeremy Hill with that uh, play there. Now it's 3rd and 10. Now watch this play here. Blake Bortles out here uh, in the shotgun. He sees Blitz is coming, or he thinks it's coming, but we drop back in coverage, and it doesn't matter because he completes the pass anyway. So got to get this together because Blake Bortles got a couple of completions. But here we are in the same drive. Later on, inside the red zone, Bortles looking. Under pressure, why can't – I don't know. Do all my players have on submit mittens? At least all the defensive players have on cement mittens because they keep hitting their hands and not catching the ball. Here we go. We get the ball back. Didn't last long. The Aaron Donald bust straight through the line for a sack. But we coming right back. Rapid fire play calling. EJ Manuel back over the middle. Brandon Tate spin me. Spin me again. He's going to the crib. Give me that. Uh. The touchdown, 7-3 lead at that point. Blake Bortles back looking to pass again. Look at this, another man. Cement mittens. Cement mittens. What is wrong with everybody's fingers out here today? Huh, 7-3. Here he is, strong eye formation. He is going to play fake. We bring in pressure. Boy, I'm telling you, you're going to see. That's a common thing. Guys rolling out right and burning me down the field. I don't. I gotta get I gotta stop that. I gotta stop that. Bortles this time another man with cement mittens. Somebody gotta catch something. But it at least forced him to kick a field goal. But those are squandered opportunities. These are like pick six opportunities that we're not coming up with. That don't work. Seven to six. And watch this play change the line of scrimmage. Look at my boy Jeff Dimps. Hey yo, JD's home. Going deep down the same look, Jeff. Look, Jeff. Alright, alright, alright. Inside, deep into their territory. We got something going, right? We got something going. No, we don't. We ain't got nothing. We ain't got nothing. Because EJ Manuel just threw a bad pass. But look at this, though. How come my dudes dropped three interceptions? But he every, immediately. Oh, I take advantage of all my opportunities. I'm a very opportunistic young man. What is with what? How come I can't get nothing happen? Anyway, third quarter, Moore back catches the ball. E.J. Manuel back again, look at the pass. Look at this. Look at this. Now, these are bad passes. I own up to that. But why don't none of they players got on cement mittens? This is going back to the house for a touchdown, and we done lost the lead. What is going on? Chance to try to turn something. Look at this. This is fourth down play. Jeff Dimps, come on now. Give me the reach for the ball. What's, what says down? The ball under what? They said that I didn't get a first down. So I ended up losing this game because that was fourth down, and we couldn't get the conversion. I think I don't think I was done properly in this game. I don't think I was done properly at all. Submit mittens, bad spots on crucial fourth downs, and then I gave up a touchdown late, but it really didn't matter because, I, man, listen, I'm angry. I got 7,220 uh, coins, so I'm almost at the point where I can buy me a pro pack, but these pro, man, look, man, look. Look, I got a dude dancing in the back. Get in the locker room, fool. What is he doing? Do you realize the game is over? Why are you just standing there partially in view? And then here comes a silly ref. What are y'all doing? Y'all just doing Zumba or something? Get out of here. Whatever, man. We got to go into this next game against the Seahawks. Against C-O-W. Uh, I think that's what that says. The font is a little high there. But this is one of those guys. I'm going to be honest. Everybody hates to play with the little running around quarterback guy who all he does is run around and try to make a play and just irritates the Jesus out of you. Well, this guy got Johnny Manziel. So look at, look at what he does here. You get sacked right there for running around too much. Sit down. But he was a problem. I'm not going to lie. He was a problem. And look at me here. I got control of the safety. That's the first bad thing here, especially against a dude like Manziel. So here I do. I come. I break all types of rules, leaving the middle of the field wide open. You can't be doing that, man. That's. I know better than that. I know better. 
and I gave up a touchdown. Seven to nothing. Now here they are on the second drive, on a, on a separate drive. Actually, in the second quarter, Manziel rolling to his right. Manziel, look at this. That same roll to the right play. Get somebody open. I gotta stop that. I gotta stop that. I didn't stop it there. But EJ Manuel with the pass to Brandon Tate gets it down to about the 26 yard line. He's not done. EJ Manuel back again. Looking, going deep inside the Seahawk territory. About out to about the nine yard line. That sets up this little simple run in for the touchdown. We're on the board. It's 14 to 7. All right. Now, watch him. He's making a boo boo. Where's your safety at? Little fella, not close enough to give Richard Sherman some help. Everybody got Richard Sherman now they gave him away, but Richard Sherman just got toast. What's up? Woo ha! I got you all in tech. Bust around looking fool. Touchdown, deep ball, Brandon Tate, 14 to 14. Two minutes remaining. We gotta get a stop because we need to get this ball back, right? That's what we need. Uh-oh. That ain't gonna work out. That ain't gonna work out. A little pass in the flat, he getting me with the little jukes and everything. Now He's got guys in motion, 131 remaining in the fourth quarter. He's trying to get a score. Manziel rolling to his right. Manziel run his man open again. I hate that. I hate it. I know how to stop it too. You got to spy that dude and you run the flat zones and you be able to take that away and I ain't doing it. I let them score here. I went into the quarter defense because I was like, you know what? I got to let them score. I don't have any, you know, I knew I was out of timeouts. I had to hurry up and get the ball back, right? Because they could have run the clock down. We get desperation time coming here. We got desperation time. That ball, that, that pass is caught. We are just almost inside uh, Seahawk territory, but we don't have any timeouts. So this is dire straits. Manuel going deep down the seam is caught, but there is no time left on the clock. Oh my God. I don't know. This chaps my hide almost as much as the submit mitten game maybe more because i really truly believe i was better than this guy and he man zealed me i don't like it i don't like it not one bit but i got enough for a pro pack i'm gonna buy it a little bit later on y'all stay tuned for the next episode of my mutt journey my mutt journey ain't going too good i'm getting beat y'all like this video still please subscribe follow and god bless